The root is to be pulled out, out of the anchoring earth. It is to be roped, tied and pulled out, snapped out or pulled out entirely out from the earth cave and the strength of the tree exposed the source white and weight the most sensitive hidden for years inside the earth now the poet is describing the method to kill a tree permanently to kill it not to chop it or cut it now the poet has adopted a technique a method called reverse psychology in order to create awareness among the hearts of his readers awareness to conserve trees what is reverse psychology reverse means just the opposite in order to make people aware to conserve trees the poet is describing an opposite thing how to kill the tree brutally in order to create pathos or sympathy in the hearts of the readers so when you want something opposite and you just say the opposite of what you want in order to make the other person understand is a technique called reverse psychology here also the poet is using reverse psychology he is describing to you all about the tedious task of killing a tree about the brutal and ruthless task of killing a tree that we do nowadays by describing about the ruthlessness he wants us to feel for the trees feel for ourselves and the importance of conserving trees so in this para he is going to say how to kill a tree no so chopping jabbing cutting won't do it won't kill the tree the mammoth of a tree the gigantic tree what is to be done then the root is to be pulled out okay the root is to be pulled out you just cannot chop and cut it the roots are the major components of a tree that holds it firmly to the ground so the roots needs to be need to be pulled out out of the anchoring earth so here it is a metaphor earth is being compared to a ship and its anchors are down in the depth of the ocean i mean not letting it go out into the wide open sea but letting it you know uh, pulled towards the banks so you see the root is to be pulled out out of the anchoring art here the art is like the ship and the anchors of the ship are you know just sticking very tight to the grounds it is to be roped the anchors that is the roots are to be roped and tied and pulled out and then cut snapped out the roots needs to be cut out the roots are compared to the anchor and the huge earth the soil of the earth is being compared to a ship or pulled out entirely one must uproot the trees out from the earth cave and the strength of the tree exposed and then only the actual strength of the tree will be exposed to the killer to the murderer who is causing the tree to bleed and the strength of the tree exposed so now the real strength of the tree will be exposed and revealed to all to the murderer to the brutal killer what is the strength of the tree the portion the part from where it had grown and the part is white and wet it refers to the sap of the tree the fluid the crust the core of the tree from where it had taken all the ingredients required for its growth once the 
roots are uprooted then only the actual strength of the tree will be exposed that is the portion from where it had grown to its full height and length the most sensitive and this is the part the most sensitive part hidden for years inside the earth the mother earth the mother earth had hidden her child's trees most sensitive area under the earth for ages and ages she had protected it so that no intruder comes but here finally when the roots are uprooted one can reach to the hidden and the most sensitive part of the tree from where one is able to kill it completely last para then the matter of scorching and choking in sun and air browning hardening twisting withering and then it is done so you see then the matter then it is just a matter of time once you are able to uproot the roots of the tree and expose the most sensitive and the hidden area to the scorching sunlight the same sunlight that had given the tree its strength to grow so then the matter it is just a matter of scorching scorching means drying up choking in sun and air browning hardening twisting withering these are all the process of the final end of the tree the process of decay the process of death and then it is done so it is a long procedure to kill a tree and it is also a difficult task to kill a tree it is not easy to kill a tree one has to take out the roots and expose the most vulnerable area of the tree which is going to harden and brown and you know get buried under the process the natural process of scorching and heating and then finally it would die when it won't be able to get any of the components required for its growth so you see it is a long long procedure so the poet is trying to create the sympathy and pathos within us that let us not indulge in this heinous action and of course a difficult action to of killing a tree thank you so much